Hey guys, what's going on, man? I hope you guys are having a great day. Uh, you're back with Peter at Mighty Profits Online. Um, I'm actually um, gonna take this time and then in this session of video that I'm gonna be showing you. Um, recently, I posted like a four to five second uh, post. It was a vehicle. Uh, it was a vehicle that I took a shot of, and uh, it's my vehicle as well. And I've kind of made this little vintage look, so so to speak. So if you can see right here is that little vintage. Okay, so um, so basically when I play it, you guys can see it loads up and it says power of blogging, my name and also the uh, and also the um, uh, the website right on the right. So how I created this was very simple. Okay, uh, it's nothing hard. I just created it right out of my iPhone uh, iPhone X. So if you guys have iPhone X or even one previous version of it, you can also do this effect too. Um, so basically, I'm gonna just minimize it. And uh, to make this effect, the first thing you want to do is you want to unlock and go into your phone. So your iPhone X or one previous version down. And uh, what you want to do is um, wherever it's saved, but it's it's called iMovie. Okay. So you go in and you would see right there, trying to focus for you guys, but iMovie right over there. So once I hit that, it's gonna open up and it's gonna give you three options. It's gonna go video or it's gonna say projects or theater. So what I do is I just, I just go into um, projects right, right now in this setting, on the project setting, I just hit the plus key and once that loads up, it's gonna ask you, uh, you wanna create a movie or you wanna create a trailer? So I want you to select the first option, okay? So first option would be the, the movie. And once the movie uh, opens up, it's before it opens, it's actually gonna ask you which file you wanna add to the movie. So you gotta have something in order to create this movie, okay? You can't just go blank, okay? So what I do is, I have select the car, so this is the original picture of my car. So I just hit the car, okay? So once I select the car, just like that, so I've selected it right now, and I hit, um, at the bottom, it'll say it's create movie. So now I'm gonna hit create movie. So what it does, it throws that image into I, uh, my a new project into iMovies, and it'll start at the last frame of it. So you wanna pull it right to the front. So press, hold, and then you want to pull it right to the front, okay? Once you're at the front, that's the beginning of the video. You don't want to be at the end because we're we don't want we're not there yet, okay? So now, once you're in there, what you're gonna do is you, there's a little button down here, and so there's a little uh, it's like a settings button. So you hit that little button right there, touch it. This pops up. So the first thing, the first very thing you, you want to do is you want to actually select the one that I use. There's so many to use, but actually the one that I've used is the black and white. Okay, so I'm going to use black and white. Choose the one that you like, okay? Anyone can do, but I, I choose the black and white. But there's also the silent era. So the one that I use in there is is the silent error okay so now hit so now once you select it you're gonna hit done okay so there you go so that's that vintage look it's like a blur kind of hitting it kind of angle but it's black and white so now it's black and white what you're gonna do is you're gonna okay so what you're gonna do is now, once you have it there, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hit the bottom where this little black space is, right in between, if you hit it, or double tap it. Okay, right there. So if you double tap right where that picture in the, is, it's gonna load up this icon. So once it loads up these menu, I want you to hold down with your fingers and scroll across and select the line underline with the underline title. So you hit that, it's like one, two, three, four, the fifth one. You hit the fifth one, this is what it looks like now. It's gonna insert it for you, okay? Okay, it's the fourth one, line and title. 
and in that line and title you can type anything you want this is your main title which is your brand so in this case mine is mighty profits profits online so I'm gonna put that you can put anything once you're done you select the second part and you're gonna also delete that text and you're gonna put in I just put in my name Peter and then to create that line effect that you see is actually if you hit the little number button down there one two three okay if you hit that button right there it's gonna go into this menu but you have to go up and then there's a more symbols so you're gonna hit that little button up there so you hit that little button now it goes into this option It's the third one right here and that's the line you hit that now you have a little line up here I hope you guys can see that it's a little line and then now I go back and I type I don't have to go with the www because once you put www it's too much wording so I just put uh, mighty profits mighty profits online and then go back to the number sign and then get the period and then go back to the thing and then just type in com and once you're done you hit done now it will say uh, which where do you want it now it's positioned right in the center you see that center button right there and now we want it to lower it so we hit the lower button and that's what it looks like right now so previously it was centered okay so if I hit center that's what it looks like okay and then now if I hit lower at the bottom here that's what it looks like okay so if you hit play that's what you got there you go and then once you're done you hit done and you go out it's gonna look like this and then there's a little button at the bottom and that's where you can hit tap it and you can copy it you can save it to files you can save the video in the third option you can do so much things with it okay you can even send it off too so in this case I just hit save video it will save it into your and they'll ask you which quality you want so me I just go with the HD 720 I want the best quality it's gonna start extracting it and once it's done you can upload it plug into your computer upload into YouTube which I did and what you can do is also in your next projects you can also make it as the first or the introduction page before your video starts rolling and then like other channels you can give it a name how to create this if this is about a blog and then you can do all sorts of things with it but this is the easiest way of doing it so there's so many other ways too um, you can use other softwares to do it um, like Adobe Premiere you can use Final Cut Pro for the Apple and um, you can use other programs there's also free programs out there too uh, another one that I use too uh, which will be on my my later videos but not right now which I'm going to show it to you guys anyways so. it's it's more it more has more so to speak more advanced features than what's given out there uh, these are very basic the ones that's on the phone but the one I'm going to be using is the movie studio 15 okay and this one actually you, you can do a lot with it too um, very basic it's for Windows right and you can um, edit videos and stuff and you can enhance videos you can share them online you can create like stunning effects too it also includes music makers so if you want to insert like a background music and stuff and there's like a free trial that you can use it for 15 30 days too so it's whatever the imagination takes you um, if if you want to if you wanted editing software and you want to go along one with this uh, probably invest this is like probably 50 bucks um, there's also like on the on the Apple there's final uh, final cut Pro X and that goes around four hundred dollars plus to actually looking almost closest to five hundred but the features that you can do on there and uh, Adobe Premiere is so much more but um, if you're really into that stuff and you're like crazy with that stuff and you want to create that video like some of the youtubers out there I, I me personally I don't recommend it but if you're really crazy and you want to you want to project all that audience out there and show them then yeah why, why, why not go ahead and try one of those and have those on your videos but it takes more time it's more time consuming also you got to know 
what you're doing as well it's not easy and uh, I just recommend this I just want to recommend something that's affordable alternative and also it's easy so this one is not like crazy advanced that you have to learn uh, it there's a little tutorial runs you through and you can pretty much do it on the fly so some of the stuff like even if you see in my videos too they're very straightforward they're not anything that's advanced yet like some of the videos out there because I'm trying to build something from scratch and then moving it forward so to speak but one of these days you're gonna see more advanced techniques but let's master the basics first and then move on to the advanced how's that sound okay but until then um, you know you can grab yourself a copy of these or you can continue watching the other videos and start to learn the ways that I do it the free ways of doing it too so uh, until then if you like this video just hit the like and subscribe button and um, for those uh, who are new and um, I want you I want to wish you all the best and success with your blogs too and uh, so far like a couple of days into it and a lot of feedbacks has been really positive some of the comments some of the emails I get um, and also um, some of the viewers are asking me so how come where, where are you getting these uh, emails from so basically on my channel when you go into my channel and if you're a subscriber already all you got to do is instead of floating down the videos there's going to be tabs at the top so you want to go into the tabs that says um that says about and then if you hit under about it'll tell you about uh the description and then underneath there there's going to be my email and then email you can send any questions any feedbacks or anything to improve the channel any feedbacks anything you want to know um, you can send it through there I check them out daily and I'll address it up on my videos on the fly so until then have a great one and we'll see you on the next next video thank you